Mill 95, we are a hop processing facility and a hop mill. Basically, we receive uh, a good majority of the hops that are grown here in Idaho, process those hops into pellets, what we call T90 pellets, which is the standard format that brewers use to apply hops to the beer. You know, hop growers here uh, traditionally worked with other mills and processors that were outside of Idaho. So all the hops had to be transported from Idaho outside the state to be processed. And the key here is that hops need to be processed and stabilized immediately to keep that freshness of the hops. The longer you wait to process them, the more deterioration happens to the hops. So Mill 95 plays an important role in keeping hops from Idaho as fresh as they can be for brewers around the country and around the world. When Mill 95 opened in 2017, it really made things super convenient for us as an Idaho grower. Also, it, it made it more flexible for us as a business because they're you know a couple miles from the farm located right in the heart of southern Idaho hop country and just really allowed us to utilize cold storage just right down the road it also allowed us to provide Idaho hops through an Idaho dealer directly to the consumer. Yeah, the way the process works is during harvest, the farmers are drying the hops and then they're putting them in about 200 pound bales. We receive those here, but we go through a major quality check as we receive all of those hops to make sure the hops that are coming in are the uh, highest quality hops that we've purchased. Once we have the bales here, we have to actually uh, put them in, in frozen storage. Uh, so we freeze the bales because that's the best way to process them. Once the hops have frozen, which uh, takes a couple of days, we'll uh, bring them into the mill and uh, bring them into what's called the bale breaker. Uh, the bale breaker basically breaks the uh, bale down. Uh, once it uh, goes through the bale breaker, we'll move it into the uh, hammer mill. After we've taken it through the hammer mill, we take it to a mixing tank where we're basically mixing up the different bales that we've brought in. From the mixing tank, we bring it into the pelletizer where we're able to uh, take that through a dye and, uh, and with the oil content and the fines, produce a perfect uh, T90 pellet that will dissolve perfectly in a brewer's uh, wort as they produce beer. We love to work with brewers around the country and even internationally looking for new and exciting hops and products that we can uh, bring to the marketplace. So here at Payette Brewing, being a local Idaho company, it's really important for us to use as many local ingredients as we can. You know, more recently as Mill 95 has come on board, we've had access to pelletized hops right here from the valley. And having the resource like Mill 95 makes it even easier for us to access these locally grown hops. They have a world-class facility there, so the products coming out of there are absolutely top-notch. Hops really are the most key ingredient when it comes to being creative, but hops are really the fireworks that makes beer happen. So it's fun to be a part of that.